Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Tonight, it's a compelling matchup of two division leaders between the Sugarland Skeeters and the Tacoma Rainiers. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. <sighs> Number 47 is on the mound for game two. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, when you dive into the numbers with this guy, he's a pretty good strikeout pitcher. Just under nine strikeouts per nine innings pitched. So I would expect him to punch out quite a few guys in this one here tonight. Get through. Throw to first, beats him easily, and the side is retired. One hit, one left. Leading off the inning, it'll be Fernando Gonzalez, and they could use a spark from him here. This is where the pressure starts to build a little bit on an offense. Yeah, it's, it's not late enough. I mean, you don't have to start panicking right now, but this is where you're looking for someone to light a spark to get back in this game. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. And you see on the graphic right there that his hitting streak will indeed live on as he just continues to hit the ball well. Just classic confidence in the box right now. You put your head on the pillow at night, you know you're on time. You get up, get dressed, drive to the ballpark, you expect to catch a couple barrels. Gonzalez stands at second with no outs. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Mm. Well, I have to give credit to him on the mound for not letting that previous pitch get to him. He wanted it, but he didn't get the call. But I love how he didn't let it affect him, and he comes right back with another good pitch and gets the punch out. There are two away now. Number 44. So next to bat will be Christian Robinson. Flew out last time up. Now the payoff pitch home. Pulls this one in the air out to left. And no trouble for him as he makes the catch to end the inning. So no runs here on a base hit, no errors, and one man left aboard. On now to the bottom half of inning number four. Tacoma leads it four to one. That's Next here one. is Fernando Gonzalez, one for two with a double on the ledger so far. Chop to first. I am gonna. And he'll step on first himself for the out. So here's the cleanup hitter, Fernando mm. Gonzalez, and they're down to their final four outs here, Dan. Yeah, that's not looking too good for them right now, Matt. They've got a significant hill to climb, but they've got to take it one bat at a time. Damn a couple it. of guys get on, and what then who knows what could happen. And this is going to find the alley as he might have himself his second double of the ball game. God damn it. Never dude. say never in this game, folks. It's late and the clock is ticking, but that RBI double might start making believers no out of the entire dugout. No we'll juice. see if they can build on it and maybe get back into this thing. Now at the plate, Rio Ruiz grounded out in his last at-bat. And he struck him out. Second time tonight now that he's been set down on strikes. Hey, this was a pretty tightly played game. Got a little bit of everything in this one. Some timely hitting. Minor League Baseball is live and on. So now here is Fernando Gonzalez looking to put them ahead early with this at bat. Oh, dude, no shot. Down into left center for a base hit. Get the ball up. Throw to second, but he's in there as they jump ahead with a run scoring on the play. Every manager and every pitcher in the league loves to play with an early lead, and they've got one here. Back-to-back -back doubles put them up by a run with the opportunity to stretch the lead here with another. And we'll just leave it there as they make the play to end the inning. Now to bat, number five. He's two for seven in the series so far. Number five. Here is a ground ball now for the shortstop to the right of second. Throw on to first in time, one away. All right, next. At the plate now is How? Fernando Gonzalez, and their runners at the I'm corners now. Right now. First offering on its way. A bouncer to the left Dude, side. Dude, are you fucking me right now? 
And the two out threat won't pay off. God, the it's inning so is over. Easy. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors in two. And now in the box, Fernando Gonzalez. He's batting cleanup in this one, but will get us started here in the inning as they look to wake up the bats. Yeah, not much to get excited about with just a single notch on the scoreboard, but you have to give credit to where it's deserved. The pitching on the other side has been really impressive. What is so different? What is different? Next, it'll be J.J. Matajevic. He was retired after popping out in his last at-bat. On the ground to third. One there. On to first, a double play. Figure it out, dude. Oh my God. So now into the box is Julio Rodriguez. Two RBIs already, looking for more here. The 1-1 home. Hit on the ground out to short. He's right there. To second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out. Yeah, we're still not winning the fucking game, bro. Digging in will be Fernando Gonzalez, singled in his last at-bat. First offering on its way. High and deep to right center. Souza on the move. He's not going to have a play on it, and this might bring home the runner from first. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one-out double. This game might be over for all intents and purposes, but somebody forgot to tell this guy. He's a grinder, and he's going to approach every at bat like it's his last. No he does it again no here and delivers a double into the gap. Soft grounder left side. Fielded cleanly. The tag gets one, but he'll put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. It seemed like everyone oh had a hand in this win. That's usually the case when you win a game fuck? by eight runs. There's no it feels way. good to dominate a game like losers. that. Nine to one is the way this one ends. The Rainiers jumped out. And will be the show's coverage of the minor. <laughs> Justin Verlander of Virginia. Good Right, so, so now it'll be here. the four hole hitter, Fernando Gonzalez, as the switch hitter will bat right handed here. And that's by on him, time? it's 0 and 1. What I love right there is no just way the it's freedom very in that, that hack. Fastball. He ain't trying to do anything but hit the baseball as far as he can. A swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. Hey, watch just out. This hitter's early. got one thing on his mind. Fuck you, bro. Swung on and chopped out to the shortstop. There's no way. And he'll go the short way to retire the side. We've played an there inning. Still no nothing, nothing. Way, bro. Sounds all right. Stepping up is Fernando Gonzalez. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. First delivery to him. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Ball. Going back is the center fielder. Gone! Finally. So a three-run blast to deep center here. So he just continues to club the baseball at an alarming rate. As they have taken the lead, it's now three to two. Well, Dero, you know, they say records are made to be broken, and what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Most RBIs in one season. I can't begin to tell you as a former offensive player what that means. Now at the play here is Fernando Gonzalez. First pitch of the A-B now. Oh, and he gets a hold of this one as it's in the air to deep left. Does he have another one? He does. It's another home run. It's a two-run shot to straightaway left. His second home run of the game. And this will make things interesting at this point. It's now a 6-5 game. I don't know what I'm doing it. Second home run of the game right there. He is locked in at the plate. You hear so many of today's players talk about rhythm and timing. Well, he is perfectly. 
digging in here for a pivotal at bat. Fernando Gonzalez and a big at bat here as he'd be the go ahead run. Well, Matt, this is one of the problems. This guy's a good fastball, particularly low fastball hitter. It doesn't matter how hard or how low you throw it. Oh, That's right into this wheelhouse. What you want to do with this guy is move the ball from the belt up to get him to chase something. That was the that game. Maybe he'll pop up in the infield. Every game the pitcher gets the lineup card, he circles the guy that can't beat him. Well, obviously, he didn't circle this guy. That's his third knock of the game, and he has been on fire lately. So stepping in is J.J. Matajevic, trying here to plate the tying run from second. And here's a swing and a miss. And that, folks, is a big out number two. Rio Ruiz to the plate now. The base knock to the outfield could score the tying run from second. Hit out towards second. Scooped up. And the inning will end as they're unable to cash in with two outs. And he just yeah. keeps on going and going. That's save number 35 for the season. And he's proven hey, to be as reliable as